Hi, I'm Rachel Greninger with Red Carpet Report, and tonight we're at the 2016 Final Draft Awards talking to writers about writing. So tell me a little bit about um, what you're most excited about for uh, here tonight. For tonight? Oh, wow, just hanging out with other writers, which is a very oh, rare wow. thing. It happens three times a year, I think, at award shows, and that's about it. Because when, when you're a screenwriter or a TV writer, you only other, you see other writers maybe in the writer's room. And if you're not on a show and you're only doing screenwriting, you never see other writers, like, ever. Like, you might run into, like, when you're not... When like you're at a Starbucks, like, yeah. you have more chance of running into a writer at a Starbucks. Yeah, 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 so that's about... So it's cool, like, you know, and, and all your lame jokes, your inside jokes, people laugh at or they know. Yeah, of course. Well, I mean, it's like, it, it, you guys are like a tribe. Like, my roommate's a screenwriter, so she's, you know, she gets into these uh, creative spirals, and she's gone for hours, and I'm like, are you, do you live here anymore? Like, it's like, I'm writing, and I'm like... Awesome. Yeah. What advice do you have for someone who's trying to get uh, their first script made or maybe they're trying to get out of a creative hole? What do you do? Go shoot something. Yes. Just go produce something because now your your iPhone's more powerful than most cameras that people use. So, yeah, so you have to do that. You got to go make stuff. So just whatever it is. Oh, yeah, when I was starting, it was all about writing a screenplay, selling a pitch, getting your studio to validate you. Now it's just about making something. So what is um, something that you're looking forward to um, maybe creating in the future? Do you have an idea sort of on the back burner that you're excited about? Oh, boy. A character who has yet to emerge? Uh, yeah, maybe create something. For, no. She's like, no, no, no. I don't want to. <laughs> like, thanks, but no. Future, I think, you know, with... with uh, genre bend at all? Yeah, or? I mean, maybe something a little bit more dramatic, because we always do comedies. So it'd be nice to do something a little bit more straight down the middle. Yeah, that's kind of funny, kind of sad, kind of this, kind of that. So that's something. That's a little well marbled, it's like a whole really good full. And I'm hoping for 4D, really. That's what I want. Wouldn't that, isn't it just going outside? Uh, yeah, it is. But I think the next generation um, is going to be sort of that 4D experience where you sit in the theater and not only is it 3D, but you get to see, like, not only things coming at you, but you can see things to the right and to the left. It's sort of the. So, how does writing for something that that's potentially 4D, how does that change what you're writing? Well, it doesn't really change that much of the writing. It just changes the, the environment of what you would see it in. Well I, think, well, I think about it, I guess, and I think if I want something to be in 4D, I would want, like, more fruit being cut flying at me. Is that maybe way too cartoony of me? I love going to theater. I love going to stage productions. I love stage. It's so great when... You know, when the big, when the, uh, what's it called, the chandelier comes out over the audience. and that, So I think that will be the next thing that we get to the do. Inclusive. With, with those holograms, when the Michael Jackson hologram isn't just up on stage, he's going through the aisles and, and sort of that thing. That's kind of the way I see it happening. And I imagine it's going to open up a huge world for you, too, because if you have the option to write something like that very immersively into an audience, I mean, that's great as a writer, too. I mean, have you seen The Lion King? When they come out and sing and the entry, it's... It's amazing. So doing that with, with film in the next medium would be, that's the key. That's so exciting. Congratulations on everything. Yeah. It was nice to meet you guys. Thanks yeah, have so fun. Yeah. Thanks for watching. And if you like what you've seen here, hit like, subscribe, and in the comments below, tell me who your favorite writer is.